everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I am going to bring you a Boohoo and Nasty Gal haul. Nasty Gal? Nasty Gal. Whatever you want to call it, I'm bringing you a haul of it. Oh that rhymed. Oh we've got a poet. So I ordered these items last week. I've been watching so many Boohoo and Nasty Gal hauls here on YouTube and I just kind of got inspiration and so I've made some a little order. They're not massive orders. I've got more Nasty Gal items than Boohoo. Um, but I just thought I'd share them with you guys. I will obviously leave everything linked down below. That's better now we've got the window shut. We can't hear all the vans going past. Like I said, I'm gonna leave everything linked down below. Everything was really, really affordable as Boohoo and Nasty Girl at the moment have got some really, really good sales on. I'm also gonna be filming it slightly differently today. I'm actually gonna be kind of trying them on and talking through the clothes rather than holding up and then inserting try and clips. I'm trying to change things up a little bit here on my YouTube channel, so. Yes. So before I get into the video, if you want to subscribe to my little channel here, that would be very much appreciated. Give this video a like and write a little comment. And if you fancy following me over on my Instagram, I shall leave it on screen. I just love a little bit of Instagram and I love posting photos and I love creating content and I'm just kind of loving my little world that I'm creating on here. So yes, if you want to join my little family, that would be very much appreciated. But if you want to see what I got from Nasty Girl and Boohoo, then please keep watching. Mm. So I got, I've already opened them because I wanted to see, but I've got two big bags from Nasty Girl and Boohoo. So I will start with Nasty Girl first. So the first item is actually this item I've got on here. So it's this really, really beautiful lilac, thick, chunky cardigan. I am just absolutely ready for autumn as much as I don't want summer to end because I just love the summer months. I am kind of ready for autumn and I think the weather in the UK is kind of heading for autumn anyways now as the sun is gone and we've now just got rain and wind and cold. So I had to pick up my very first cardigan of the year. I absolutely love this one. It's kind of got quite a deep v-neck here so you could almost wear this off the shoulder and kind of have it more slouchy. I have just tucked it into some high-waisted jeans here. I absolutely love this. I can't remember the price of these items but I will leave them on screen and I will leave the picture of what they sh are shown like on the website. I just think it's so so cute. They did this in so many different colours as well. I think they did it in a cream, a black, I want to say a mint green. I kind of went with purple as I don't have anything purple in my wardrobe. It's super soft. Yeah, I just love this one. Okay, so the next item I picked up from Nasty Girl is this loungewear two-piece. Now, unfortunately, I'm gonna be sending this one back as it just doesn't quite fit right. So I will show you what it looks like on the website and I just absolutely fell in love with it on the website and it was always out of my size. It was always out of stock for ages and ages. And then I finally saw it back in a size 10. I was like, I have to pick this up. So this was only £16 because they have a 50% off sale at the moment. But the difficult thing with me is that because I'm six foot tall, sometimes things don't quite fit right. So the gap here is a bit bigger than I was expecting and it's very, very cropped. So you can probably see like my bra is literally just there. So I would feel like I'm constantly having to pull this down over my boobs to keep them covered. And yes, it sits quite nicely, a high waist on my waist. The issue is, is you probably can't see it, but... I'll see if I can show you. So they're just really short on the leg and that's through no fault of Nasty Girl's fault. That's kind of my fault for being the height I am. And it just, it's just hitting me off at the ankles. It's just cutting off at the ankles and it just, it's not really a vibe is all I can say. So unfortunately I'm gonna be sending this one back. The sleeves are slightly too short on me as well. I just think it's just designed for a smaller person and that is absolutely fine i'm just gutted really because i was just hoping this was going to be like a really cute loungewear set that i was probably just going to live in but unfortunately you have to go back this was only 16 pounds and they also did this in like a sage green color so if anyone fancies picking this up who's a little bit shorter than me i definitely definitely recommend it Okay, so next up is something a little bit different for me. So this is actually a dress that I picked up. This was only £20. Now I saw this on a YouTuber's Nasty Girl haul here. She's called Emily Diane Philpot. I will leave her YouTube channel down below. And she did like a massive Nasty Girl haul. And I kind of, this is where I got most of my inspiration from. She picked up this dress and 
I thought it was just so, so cute. Now, I'm hoping to still go away on holiday in September with my boyfriend. And I just thought this would be such a beautiful little dress to wear in the evening to go out for dinner. It does need an iron or it does need a steam. I am fully aware of that fact. But it's got these beautiful kind of bell-like sleeves, but they are almost that sheer mesh kind of material. And then it kind of does button up. I know on the website, they did it all the way up and then it kind of belts like this. I think, I think that's how you do it. Yeah, it kind of ties like this on the website, but like um, Emily was wearing it, I think it's just really nice to just kind of have it relaxed and kind of loose. And then it's kind of a really nice floaty material. And the good thing is, is the skirt is double lined, so it's not see-through at all. I still would recommend obviously wearing lighter underwear or nude colour underwear, but this is just so cute. And on me, I'll see if I can go with it toes. So it is quite short on me, but again, I am six foot tall and I have quite a long body. So dresses do often come up short on me, which is not a problem. And I just thought on holiday, this would be so, so cute. And for 20 pounds, 20 pounds, this is not bad at all. And I am just, I'm very, very happy with this purchase. And I just think, I feel like in a dress like this, I just want to like frolic in a field. Is that weird? Maybe it's a little bit weird, but yeah really 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 happy with this purchase so the next item are these i've just paired them with this black bodysuit just so i could show you together what they look like but these are just some high-waisted tailored white shorts and i cannot tell you enough how much i am obsessed with these these are just kind of doing everything for my figure now my figure i am very kind of wide on the bottom half and that's always been my figure and i've kind of been slimmer up top and then have quite large broad large not large, have quite broad shoulders. Um, oh. Honestly, the amount of police cars that go past my flat is ridiculous. But yeah, these shorts are just doing absolute bits. Now, they kind of sit perfectly on my waist. They have got belt loops as well, so I could kind of pair a belt with it to make it more of an outfit. But again, I just thought these would be so nice on holiday. That's what they look like from the back. These would just be so nice on holiday with kind of a little black crop or even a little cream crop and just kind of make it an all white outfit. And when you're tanned, oh, oh honey, this is gonna be a look. These were only 11 pounds. So I am just so, so happy with these. Obviously they are cream, so they are a little bit see-through. So obviously I have paired it with a black bodysuit. So you can see the bodysuit underneath. So if you were gonna wear this just on their own, I would obviously recommend wearing light underwear or cream colored underwear again. I am so happy with these. Again, I stole these off Emily's Nasty Girl haul. I just saw them and they looked amazing on her. And yeah, I'm so happy. I got these in a size 10 as well. So didn't even need to size up, which is great. And it's not tight around my hips either. There's still plenty of kind of movable room, which is just makes me feel happy that I'm still a size 10. So boys and girls, this next piece is a little bit risky for me. So this is a little snake print, snake print bikini that I picked up. This was, this was only 10 pounds. Now I got this in a size 10 and the issue that I'm having is kind of the top half and these cup sizes are just not very big in the slightest. And the issue is, is that the material across the back does not have much stretch in it at all. And it kind of ties here at the front. When I show you a picture of what it looks like on the model, the model doesn't look like she has the biggest chest anyways. However, it doesn't look pulled really, really tight underneath it to kind of keep it all in place. While this bow, if this bow goes, then you're gonna be seeing all kinds of boobage, which we just don't really wanna see. So I feel like I'm gonna to have to send this back. It's a really beautiful bikini, but it's just not giving me much coverage at all up top. And I would just be worried if I'm chilling by the pool and then suddenly just like a tip was gonna come out. And I just don't feel like that's a vibe. I do love the bottoms. However, again, they're just not the biggest piece of material. And due to the way I was born, I had a problem with my hips. So my hip bones aren't actually joined together. That means I've got quite a large thigh gap. And unfortunately, some bikinis, they just don't provide enough material to kind of cover me. And it's just not a look really on the beach or by the pool. So especially some of the O'Poly bikinis, I would never ever be able to wear any of them because that is like enough to floss your teeth with. So I feel like I'm gonna have to send this one back. It's a really beautiful print and it's a gorgeous material but I'm just kind of I feel like I'll be so self-conscious about it and because I'll be worried that my boobs are going to come out or I'll be worried that downstairs is showing so 
maybe not. Now the final item that I picked up from Natty Gal was this little beach cover up. Now this again is so so cute. It's almost like a cropped black t-shirt but then if I show you here it has two kind of extended pieces here that you tie up so you can kind of button it up as much as you want or have it unbuttoned kind of tie it really loosely I think it's really cute just kind of one off to one shoulder this would be really nice to throw on if you were on holiday and you were kind of on the beach but then you needed to go into a cafe or needed to go into a restaurant for some food so you could kind of pop on like some denim shorts and like throw this over the top. This again was only £11 and I just think it's really, really cute. The material is really nice. It's kind of that soft beachy material. It's doing kind of all sorts. So if I kind of bring it up, you can kind of have it straight on and it has got a collar. You can kind of have it like this. The sleeves are kind of like that wide leg. They're not cuffed. Wide leg? kind of that wide sleeve but they're not cuffed at all they're really soft and loose fitting yeah i'm just really really happy with this definitely think i'm going to keep this one if i don't keep the bikini so that was everything that i picked up from nasty gal moving on now to boohoo i only picked up two clothing items and one accessory item so the first things first is a top that you would have seen in my previous video which was a little vlog style video that i went on a date night but i will pop it back on and show it again for you so this is a little top from boohoo now this is so cute i love it this was only 11 pound 25 what so it's just this really beautiful square neckline top with these kind of puff mesh sleeves that go all the way down. They are cuffed at the bottom and then kind of have this, I don't really know what to call this, but kind of outward sleeve at the bottom. It has these tight wraparound pieces and then it kind of just ties at the back and it's got really long straps. So you can go kind of round as many times as you like. I've just paired it with the, um, with the white tailored shorts from Nasty Gal. I think this is an outfit together. I'll just go on with it so she can see this as an outfit together is just so so cute i love this top they had this in white and in red i really wanted the white as well but unfortunately they didn't have my size so i kind of got the black i recently wore this when i went out on a date night with will i will just insert a little picture somewhere apologies for the picture because when i had it taken i didn't realize that the bottom part of my bra was kind of sticking out but i still love the picture so i was just like eh What's, what's a little bra to someone? I definitely feel like when the white comes back in stock, I'm gonna get the white on this because I think a white on holiday as well. Mm, it's a vibe. I'll just quickly show you the accessory item I picked up from Boohoo before I move on to the final piece of clothing. And it's this. So I picked up these. These are these two gold style hoops that are much chunkier than my normal ones. Now, they weren't kind of exactly what I was expecting. I'm probably going to wear the little ones more than the big ones. I was hoping they were going to be more like some ones I'd seen on Pretty Little Thing, but unfortunately they've been sold out since I've ever seen them. So I kind of found these ones on Boohoo and hope for the best. They're not quite what I was expecting, but I'm definitely still going to be able to wear them. I mean, I always rock a hoop. I say this, I don't actually have one in now, but I think hoops just go with any sort of outfit. A girl can never have too many hoops. So I love these. These were so inexpensive. I think these were four pounds, I think. So that's like a pound an earring. So, oh, I'm so annoyed. I just filmed the last bit of the video, but my phone, it didn't press record. So <sighs> anyways, this is the final item that I picked up and I am obsessed. This is by far my absolute favourite item. This is just the most beautiful long line cream knitted cardigan. And I can't even tell you, I can't even stress to you enough how soft this is. It is so soft and this was only £15. Now this goes past my knees on me. So again, if you're smaller than me, which a lot of people are, then this is gonna be a really beautiful long maxi cardigan and it's just gonna be so cozy. I know the items underneath don't completely match as the kind of creams are slightly different colors, but they did a matching set in this. So they also did a cropped up and trouser loungewear set that matches this. And I think I'm gonna have to order it. And because this together, Oh, that is going to be a vibe. I am so obsessed with it. It's so cozy. I am so ready to wear this in the colder months, which is now. And I am so ready to just kind of watch films, get cozy, have cups of tea with this on. And oh, I am so, so happy with this purchase. I think it is amazing so that is it that is everything that i recently picked up from boohoo and nasty girl i hope you guys all have enjoyed like i said i will leave all of the products linked down below i think we've had a pretty good run there's only a couple of things 
couple of items that I'm going to be sending back purely because they just don't fit right more so than that I don't actually like the items I love all the clothes but unfortunately sometimes sometimes I struggle with items of clothing but it's what it is if you have liked this video please give it a little like and if you've made it to the end well done because it was a little long one so if you really fancy joining this little family hit that subscribe button and if you fancy following me over on my instagram and i have got a little tiktok too then that would be so greatly appreciated i will leave all the information in the description bar down below too because i'm sending a couple of items back that means it's an excuse to kind of go shopping again and get some more items so i'm pretty sure there'll be more hauls coming your way but like i said i hope you all have enjoyed and i will see you all in the next one bye